Jesus mini verb too. Jesus. Yeah, it's it's. Hear it? Yeah, yeah. yeah it just uh, I only use three settings. Uh, two of them are reverbed, and the other one is a, a delay for initiation, which is. Right. The other reverb is this one right here. Yeah. And the shorter one. Like that. See, when I'm playing, uh, when I'm playing a tune, you can't really hear it unless I do that. So you can't hear this reverb. Either. Shot. It's technology from the 80s, um, but it's it, it's part of my sound. Mm -hmm. um, and the fact that I uh, <laughs> the reason one of the main reasons why I use this was I know it so well. And, and, I, and the reverb, the, the longer reverbs, like the this one here, they wow, it's quite nice. But I, I don't um, I don't put a lot of reverb on myself from the stage. I, I let my sound man do the stereo reverbs, right? And we, we carry our own reverbs and our own, uh, like a, he has another rack like this. It has two graphic equalizers in it and a new Korg S1000. Um, no, not Korg, TC Electronics. T, the TC uh, reverb, which is the very latest one. And it has incredible reverbs in it. And it's not expensive, it's like $600. And it's a rack mount thing. And it's really easy to use. So I just have a little bit here so I can hear a bit of reverb on stage. But I can mostly hear it in the PA. So it's kind of like one reverb on top of another. But the, 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 the one that is in the PA makes my sound very wide and very fluid, you know. Mm -hmm. So if I put too much reverb on, I'll, I'll get lost in there. You know, so. And w whenever I use a long reverb, I always bring the mid range up on my guitar a little bit, which compensates for, for the because the reverb sets, sets you back a little bit. You know, so you want to you want the melody and the notes to come out and to trigger the reverb. So you bring the like when I play somewhere over the rainbow or, or uh, a song like that, I bring the mid range up. So here here's a normal mid range setting for me. And then I want the want the mid range to speak better. I just bring it out. So, hear that? And then I can play gently. Important, important to use mid range through the right way. So that's that's what I, I do there. So how many notches up above? Yeah, you know where the metal yeah. is on, on your graphic line. Yeah. How many notches above? Or three it's not in, nowhere near the middle. It's here's it, here's no yeah. mid range at all. Now here's. Itself has has lots of nice mid range, and then when you add the pickup in the mic, it, it amplifies it. But then you know it depends what sort of sound you're looking for. Um, I also play in a way that um, I, don't, I don't know whether we need, need those lines, buddy. Okay, so I just asked for. Thank you. Yeah, probably gonna. Thanks, brother. 